welcome friends in this tutorial we learn about the statement first of all we see the type of statement there are many type of statements in the python language expression statements assignment statement the assert statement the pass statement the deal statement the print statement return statement yield statement raise statement break statement continue statement and many more now we see this statement in the deep first is the expression statement expression statements are used to compute and write a value or to call a processor return no meaningful result other uses of expression statements are allowed and occasionally useful the syntax for an expression statement is expression statement is equal to expression list the next one is assignment statement assignment statements are used to bind names to values and to modify attributes or items of mutable objects like example assignment statement is equal to target list plus expression list or yield expression assignment of an object to a target list is recursively defined as if the largest is a single largest the object is assigned to that target if the target list is a comma separated list of targets the object must be an iterable with the same number of items as there are targets in the target list and the items are assigned from left to right to the corresponding target an assignment statement evaluates the expression list and assign the single resulting object to each of the target list from left to right now we see the assert statement assert statements are convenient way to insert a debugging assertion into a program here it gives the syntax for the statement the next statement is the pass statement pass is a null operation when it is executed nothing happens it is useful as a placeholder when a statement is required syntactically synthetically but no code needs to be executed for example definition f argument and pass now we see the delete statement deletion is a recursively defined very similar to the way assignment is defined rather than spelling it out in a full details here are some hints delete statement is equal to delete and target list deletion of a name removes binding of that name from the local or global namespace depending on whether the name occurs in a global statement in the same code block if the name is unbound a name error exception will be raised deletion of a target list recursively deletes each target from left to right now we see the print statement print il evaluates each expression in turn and writes the resulting object to standard output if an object is not a string it is first converted to a string using the rules for string conversion the string is the return objects which act like file object but which are not the built in the file object often do not property this aspect of the file objects behavior so it is based not to ready on this standard output is defined as the file object name std out in the built in module system now we see the return statement 
रिटर्न में ओनली अकार साइमेंटिकली नेस्टेड इन अ फंक्शन डेफिनेशन नॉट विद इन अ नेस्टेड क्लास डेफिनेशन रिटर्न स्टेटमेंट इज इक्वल टू रिटर्न एंड एक्सप्रेशन लिस्ट रिटर्न लिव्स द करंट फंक्शन कॉल विद द एक्सप्रेशन लिस्ट एज रिटर्न वैल्यू एंड एक्सप्रेशन लिस्ट इज present it is evaluated as none is substituted in this way we see the different type of statement in this tutorial thank you friends